Any of you uh, read the latest Rolling Stone? I was on the phone for a long time last night. And a friend of mine, a friend of mine was telling me how, shut the fuck up. Yo, Axel, cool metal, dude, rock and roll party, do cocaine, yeah. I ain't here for that. Anyway, there was a friend of mine who was telling me how how some of the members of my family Interpreter, please. We have some really fucking stupid people here tonight. Hay alguna gente estúpida esta noche. Who think that throwing things at the stage will relate into a better show. Si ustedes siguen tirando cosas, no podremos hacer un show bueno. It won't happen that way. No podrá ser así. Because we will fucking go home. Porque nos vamos a ir a casa. Don't try me. No, no lo hagan. Now shall we continue or shall we go home? Podemos continuar o nos vamos a casa. Okay. Interpreter. Do you think camera on this fucker? Una cámara en esto, por favor. Do you think that this is funny? Ustedes creen que esto es gracioso? If you see somebody beside you. Si ustedes ven a alguien al lado suyo throwing something tirando algo beat the fucking shit out of them Péguenle. all they are going to do todo lo que van a hacer is rip every one of you off es golpearlos if one of us gets hit by something like this si alguien si a alguien le cae eso encima or if I see someone in the crowd get hit by someone, something like this. Si él ve a alguien que tira a otra persona una cosa como esta. 
Unfortunately, the show will be over. Infortunadamente, el show va a terminar. We want to have a nice time tonight. Queremos tener una noche agradable esta noche. We don't want anyone to get hurt, any of you. No queremos que nadie salga herido, ninguno de ustedes. Any of our crew. Ninguno de nosotros. Any of the people working the show. Ninguno de la gente que está trabajando en este show. Or ourselves. O nosotros. This. Esto. Could hurt someone real fucking bad. Puede herir a alguien muy mal. This will be the last time I talk about this. Esta va a ser la última vez que yo hable sobre esto. We'll try one more time. Vamos a tratar una vez más. Thank you. Gracias. Somos amigos, no enemigos. Save that. All right. Give me the interpreter. An interpreter. Hello, what is your name? Well. Is you know this is Noel? Hi. If, if you want to throw another fucking bottle, we will fucking go home. Okay? Comprendo? Thank you. Gracias. Thank you. Izzy Stradlin? Who the fuck is Izzy Stradlin? Izzy wrote this song. And I think it's a song all about himself. And this is for Izzy, and it's called Double Talking Jive Motherfucker. Get that punk right behind him. Right there. That guy. The one hiding. Get him the fuck out of here. That guy right there. They're all... Right there. Slack, he's got a, or he's got a red shirt. Yeah, he goes. Get some light. Here we go. Okay, people. You guys can spit on each other. Have a good night. No tienen cosas si no les escupan. 
Shut the fuck up! We'll wait till you shut the fuck up. You're gonna be quiet so she can talk? Okay, come here. Cayenne said, por favor. Escuchen. Por favor, no tiren botellas, no escupan y no tiren cosas porque se van. Es en serio. Por favor. Gracias. If you see somebody throwing shit, spitting shit, lighting shit on fire, si ven a alguien tirando algo, escupiendo o haciendo algo malo, beat the fuck out of them. Échenlo. Gracias. Thank you, Noel. So we're kind of like around the Bay Area, right? Good. So it's kind of like we're we're here on somebody else's turf in a way. Some people we we used to like to think that we were homeboys or something. We'll talk about maybe your good friends, I don't know, Metallica for a minute. Let me, let me tell you a couple of things about Metallica. First off, they do a lot of bitching for a band who got paid about 20-30% more than fucking what they deserved at a show because they didn't bring that much. Ooh, Axel's talking now. Well, listen to that. He's, who's he think he is? I'll tell you who I think I am. I thought I was friends with these people. You know, I don't know how long they were on the road, but there was nobody in their crew that had ever got a bonus or paid anything extra for working their fucking ass off and slaving for that man. I pretty much watched a lot of people get treated like shit and it wasn't very enjoyable. I watched a man named James prove that, you know, see, since I'm supposed to be the rock racist, because I used a word once, I watched a man show me that he was a motherfucking racist. I had a real big problem with iced tea and any black man is actually, you know, my rap is really terrible and black man is like, I can't handle that kind of thing. I watched them be really shitty to black people that work with us. That wasn't very enjoyable. I watched them diss on other people like Sebastian and shit. People that like, love this fucking band. They love Metallica. They would like fucking do anything for that band. But Metallica don't give a shit. Lars don't give a shit. Motherfucker calls me at four in the morning trying to kiss my ass and stuff. It's like, but I can't trust the motherfucker. Is he going to take it and figure out where to go make some more money? 
like the time that we sat around writing a video for Don't Cry and we talked about being underwater and showing all these things and then Lars runs home and writes a video. And the cool thing about it is, he caught to it. Yeah, I was ripping you guys off. I'm gonna dedicate this to these people who like to run fucking little videos with people saying, fuck you, this ain't the Guns N' Roses tour, this is my huh? <laughs> who say things like, oh, that was just a joke because we're friends. It's like, you ain't no fucking friend of mine, you fucking stupid little fucking dead rock cocksucker. This is for you, Lars, and you, James. This is called Double Talking Jive Motherfucker. Fun. And I'm fun, but somebody just hit Duff in the head with a bottle and now he's not able to play, so we're sorry. Have a good night, and if you find the asshole, kill him. <laughs>